Welcome back to Z Coins. Today we're diving deep into the intriguing world of one of the rarest coins in American history, the 1973 one cent dime. Yes, you heard that right, a one cent dime. And guess what? It's valued at an astonishing $1.9 million today. Stick around to find out why this tiny coin is worth so much, the history behind its minting, and how a mistake could turn something ordinary into a collector's dream. Let's get started. So, what exactly is a 1973 one cent dime? Well, this rare coin is actually a mint error, and like many valuable coins, its story begins with a simple mistake at the United States Mint. In 1973, the U.S. Mint was busy producing millions of coins for circulation. Amid all the hustle and bustle, a dime planchet, which is the blank metal disc used to strike coins, somehow got mixed up with a penny die. Now, normally, dimes are struck on smaller planchets made of a different metal alloy. However, this particular dime was struck on a copper planchet intended for a penny. This error resulted in a coin that has the size and appearance of a dime, but the weight and color of a penny. And thus, the legendary 1973 one cent dime was born. How could something like this happen, you ask? The 1970s were a period of high production at the U.S. Mint, with billions of coins being struck each year. Errors were not uncommon, but the creation of a hybrid coin like the 1973 one cent dime is exceptionally rare. There are a few theories about how this error occurred. Some suggest it was a simple oversight. The mint workers could have accidentally loaded a penny planchet into the machine designated for striking dimes. Others speculate it might have been due to a malfunction in the sorting process, where the wrong metal blank ended up in the wrong batch. What makes this error even more intriguing is that it was discovered much later, many years after the coins had been in circulation. The unique appearance of the coin, looking like a penny but with the inscriptions and size of a dime, caught the eye of a keen collector who decided to have it examined by experts. Imagine stumbling upon this coin in your pocket change or an old coin collection. The discovery of the 1973 one cent dime sent shockwaves through the numismatic community. When the coin was first examined by experts, they realized just how rare and unique it was. It wasn't just another mint error. It was a once-in-a-lifetime find. The initial valuation of the coin was impressive, but it has only increased over time. At first, collectors speculated it could be worth a few thousand dollars due to its rarity. However, as more numismatists examined the coin and confirmed its authenticity, the value skyrocketed. The most recent auction saw this coin fetch a jaw-dropping $1.90 million. So, why exactly is this coin worth a staggering $1.9 million today? There are a few key factors driving its value. The 1973 one cent dime is incredibly rare, with only one known to exist. In the world of coin collecting, rarity is king. The fewer coins there are, the higher the demand from collectors. This coin is a mint error, and not just any error, a unique hybrid error. Errors like these are highly sought after by collectors because they are anomalies, mistakes that tell a story about the minting process and its history. The condition of a coin plays a massive role in its valuation. The 1973 one cent dime was found in exceptional condition, preserving its features and the error that makes it unique. This coin represents a moment in minting history, a testament to the human element behind coin production. It's a physical piece of history, carrying with it the story of a time when mistakes could still slip through the cracks. Currently, the 1973 one cent dime holds a market value of around $1.9 million, but who knows what the future holds. The value of rare coins can fluctuate based on market demand, economic factors, and even changes in collecting trends. Point one thing is for sure, as long as there are coin collectors and enthusiasts out there, the value of this extraordinary piece is likely to remain high. It's a reminder that sometimes, even the smallest, most unassuming objects can hold incredible value 
and capture our imaginations. Here's an exciting thought. Could there be more 1973 one cent dimes out there? Just waiting to be discovered? It's entirely possible. With billions of coins in circulation, there could be other error coins hiding in plain sight. So, check your pocket change, dig through your old piggy banks, and examine your coin collections. You never know, you might be holding a million dollar treasure without even realizing it. If you think you've found a rare coin or just want to learn more about the value of your collection, it's essential to get your coins appraised by a reputable expert. There are many certified coin appraisers who can provide insights into the value and history of your coins. We're diving deep into a coin that has taken the collecting world by storm. The 1987 penny that is now worth a whopping dollar 1.8 million. Yes, you heard that right. A penny that's worth millions. So, if you've got a jar of old coins lying around, you might want to grab it now and see if you have one of these hidden treasures. Let's get started. All right, so let's start with the basics. The 1987 penny, or one cent coin, is part of the Lincoln Cent series. It features the familiar image of President Abraham Lincoln on the obverse, which has been the design since 1909. The reverse side, which you're probably familiar with, shows the Lincoln Memorial, a design used from 1959 until 2008. Now, on the surface, the 1987 penny might look just like any other penny, but there are some key differences that make it incredibly rare and valuable. To understand why the 1987 penny is so special, we need to take a quick trip back in time to the 1980s. During this decade, the U.S. Mint was producing billions of pennies every year. Most of these coins were made of copper-plated zinc, as the cost of producing all copper pennies had become too expensive due to rising metal prices. However, in 1987, something strange happened. A very small number of pennies were struck using an experimental planchet, a blank metal disc used to make coins, that wasn't supposed to be used for the one cent denomination at all. So, what exactly makes the 1987 penny worth $1.8 million? It's all about a mint error. This particular penny was accidentally struck on a dime planchet, a blank that was intended for making dimes, not pennies. This error resulted in a penny that is slightly smaller in diameter and has a distinct silver color, unlike the typical copper appearance of a regular penny. These error coins are known as off-metal errors, and they are extremely rare because they result from a mistake in the minting process. Only a handful of these 1987 pennies struck on dime planchets have ever been discovered making them incredibly valuable to collectors. The first of these error pennies was discovered in the early 1990s by a sharp-eyed collector who noticed the odd color and size of the coin. At the time, error coins were already a hot topic in the numismatic community, but this discovery was unprecedented. When it first hit the market, the 1987 penny struck on a dime planchet was valued at a few thousand dollars. For a while, it remained a hidden gem among collectors who were lucky enough to come across one. Fast forward to today, and the value of this rare error coin has skyrocketed. The coin's rarity, combined with the fascination of mint errors among collectors, has driven its price up to an astonishing $1.8 million. So, what caused this dramatic increase in value? There are a few factors at play here. Firstly, the coin collecting hobby has grown significantly over the years, with more people becoming interested in rare and unique pieces of history. Secondly, as more collectors learn about the rarity of this specific error, demand has naturally increased. And lastly, the story behind the 1987 penny struck on a dime planchet adds an element of intrigue that makes it even more desirable. Now, the big question is, how can you identify if you have a 1987 penny struck on a dime planchet? Here are a few things to look for. The error penny is slightly smaller in diameter than a regular penny because it was struck on a dime planchet. 
It also weighs about 2.27 grams, compared to the standard 2.5 grams for a copper-plated zinc penny. Unlike the typical copper color of a penny, this error coin has a silvery appearance, much like a dime. The edge of this error penny is smooth, like a regular penny, but because it's on a dime planchet, the rim may appear slightly raised compared to a regular penny. Look for the 1987 year on the obverse side and check for the P-Mint mark, which indicates it was minted in Philadelphia. However, some may not have a mint mark, as not all Philadelphia minted coins have one. So what should you do if you think you've found a 1987 penny struck on a dime planchet? First, don't panic. Handle the coin carefully to avoid scratches or damage. Next, you'll want to have it authenticated and graded by a professional coin grading service like PCGS or NGC. These organizations can confirm whether your coin is the real deal and give it a grade based on its condition, which can significantly affect its value. Once authenticated, you could either keep it as a treasured piece of your collection or consider selling it at a major auction house specializing in rare coins. With a current market value of $1.8 million, selling such a rare piece could be a life-changing decision. As for the future, who knows how much this rare coin could be worth in the coming years? As the number of these error coins remains extremely limited and the interest in numismatics continues to grow, the value of the 1987 penny struck on a dime planchet could potentially rise even further. It's a reminder that treasures are out there, sometimes in the most unexpected places, even in our pocket change. We've got an exciting story for you. Imagine this. You're sifting through your spare change and stumble upon a penny, only to discover that it could be worth a whopping dollar $1.7 million. Sounds unbelievable, right? Well, that's the fascinating tale of the 1999 penny we're talking about today. So grab a snack, sit back, and let's explore the incredible journey of this seemingly ordinary coin that turned out to be a treasure. First, let's talk about the penny itself. The 1999 penny, also known as a one-cent coin, features the familiar image of Abraham Lincoln on the front, or obverse side, and the Lincoln Memorial on the reverse. This design has been a staple of American currency for decades. But what makes the 1999 penny special? How does a coin that's worth just one cent become valued at one dollar and seventy cents million? The answer lies in a rare error and a unique minting process that occurred back in 1999. So, what exactly happened in 1999? The U.S. Mint which is responsible for producing all of the nation's coins, occasionally makes errors during the minting process. These errors can happen for various reasons, a misaligned die, an incorrect planchet, or even an accidental use of the wrong metal. Narrator, voice lowers for emphasis asterisk asterisk, but in the case of the 1999 penny, it's what collectors call a mule error. Now, a mule error is when two dies not meant to be paired together are used to strike a coin. This is incredibly rare, and that's what makes this 1999 penny so special. Specifically, the 1999 penny we're talking about was struck with the reverse die of a dime. That means one side of the coin is a regular penny, but the other side, the reverse, is that of a dime. A true hybrid coin. And that's why collectors are willing to pay big bucks for it. How could such a mistake happen at the U.S. Mint, you ask? Well, errors like these are often the result of a rushed production schedule or human error. Back in 1999, the Mint was producing coins at a rapid pace to meet demand, and it's believed that in the hustle and bustle, a dime reverse die was mistakenly paired with a penny obverse die. The result? a coin that was never supposed to exist. And because this error wasn't caught right away, a very small number of these coins were released into circulation.to date. Only a handful of these mule pennies have been discovered, which is why their value has skyrocketed in the collector's market. You might be wondering, how does a coin like this reach a value of $1.7 million? 
The answer lies in a combination of rarity, demand, and the uniqueness of the error.i in the world of numismatics. That's the fancy word for coin collecting. Rarity is king. The fewer coins there are, the more collectors are willing to pay. When you couple that with the fact that this is a mule error, one of the rarest types of coin errors, you've got a recipe for a high-value collectible. The 1999 penny with the dime reverse is a numismatic anomaly. There are only about 10 known to exist, and each one that surfaces makes waves in the collecting community. The most recent sale of one of these coins fetched $1.7 million at auction, setting a new record for this error type. So, if you're thinking about rummaging through your spare change right now, we don't blame you. The current market value of this rare 1999 mule penny is estimated at $1.7 million, but that could go even higher if more collectors start bidding on the remaining coins. If you're lucky enough to find one, it's like winning the lottery. But remember, it's incredibly rare. Your best bet is to check with professional coin dealers or at coin auctions. Occasionally, these rare finds are still discovered in collections or even in old coin rolls. So keep your eyes peeled. If this story has sparked your interest in coin collecting, here are a few tips to get you started. Start by familiarizing yourself with common terms and types of coins. There are many resources online including forums, books, and videos. A magnifying glass, gloves, and proper storage cases are essential for any serious collector. Join local or online coin clubs. Connecting with experienced collectors can offer valuable insights and help you learn about upcoming auctions or coin shows. Keep an eye on the latest news in the numismatic world. Coin values can fluctuate, especially when a new discovery is made. Remember, coin collecting isn't just about finding the rarest coins. It's about enjoying the history and artistry behind every piece of currency. Who knows? Maybe you'll stumble upon a hidden gem like the 1999 Mule Penny. And there you have it, folks. The incredible story of the 1999 Penny that could be worth $1.7 million. It's a fascinating example of how even the smallest items can hold immense value. So next time you're handling your spare change, take a closer look. You never know what treasure you might find. We've got a fascinating topic that's sure to entry coin collectors and history buffs alike. Imagine finding a coin in your pocket change that could be worth a staggering $1.6 million. Sounds unbelievable, right? But it's true. Today, we're diving into the story behind the 2000 and 1D1 said dime coin that has recently made headlines for its incredible value. Let's explore why this coin is so special, its history, how it came to be, and what makes it worth such an extraordinary amount today. Asterisk so, what is the 2000 and 1D1 said dime coin, and why is it causing such a stir in the numismatic community? To start, Let's clear up a common misconception. The 2001 d one cent dime coin isn't a dime at all, but rather a fascinating mint error involving a one cent coin, also known as a penny, that was struck on a dime planchet. Asterisk for those who might not know, a planchet is a blank metal disc that is prepared to be struck as a coin. Now, dimes are smaller and thinner than pennies, which makes this error particularly intriguing. This error coin is essentially a penny design mistakenly struck on a blank that was intended for a dime, creating a unique hybrid that collectors find incredibly rare and desirable. Asterisk mint errors happen from time to time, but this one is especially unusual. The Denver Mint, denoted by the D-Mint mark, produced millions of regular pennies and dimes in 2001. But in this rare instance, a penny design was struck onto a dime planchet. This kind of mistake occurs due to a mix-up during the minting process, where a blank mint for a dime accidentally ends up being fed into the press that strikes pennies. Asterisk such errors are typically caught by the mint's quality control measures, but some slip through the cracks. And when they do, they become highly prized by collectors because of their rarity and the story they tell about the minting process itself. 
asterisk all right. Let's get to the burning question on everyone's mind. Why is this coin valued at a whopping $1.6 million? There are several factors that contribute to its value. Asterisk first and foremost, rarity is the key factor. Only a few coins like this have ever been discovered, and each one is unique due to the nature of the error. The 2001 D1 said dime coin is one of a kind with this specific date and mint mark combination. Asterisk next is the condition of the coin. The value of a coin can skyrocket if it's in near perfect or uncirculated condition. The $1.6 million coin is in pristine condition, which makes it incredibly valuable to collectors. Asterisk then, there's the historical significance. Error coins like this provide a snapshot of the minting process and offer a glimpse into the mistakes that even the most sophisticated systems can make. This adds a layer of intrigue and desirability. Asterisk lastly, the market demand for such unique error coins is high. When collectors are passionate about a specific type of coin, they're often willing to pay top dollar to add it to their collection. The bidding war over this coin drove its price up to the $1.6 million mark. Asterisk so, how did this particular coin end up fetching such a high price? Let's go through its journey from being a simple mint error to becoming a million dollar treasure. Asterisk it all started when a sharp eyed collector noticed the unusual coin in their pocket change. Recognizing that this wasn't just any penny, they had the coin authenticated by a professional grading service. Asterisk the coin was graded and confirmed as an authentic mint error and its rarity was verified. From there, it was placed in an auction where its value quickly skyrocketed as collectors realized just how unique it was. Asterisk after a fierce bidding war, the coin was finally sold for an incredible $1.6 million, setting a new record for error coins of this type. Asterisk now, you might be wondering, could you have one of these valuable error coins sitting in your pocket change? The short answer is, it's very unlikely, but not impossible. Here's what you should look out for. Asterisk first, pay attention to the size and thickness of the coin. Remember, the 2001 D1 set dime coin is a penny design on a dime planchet, so it should be smaller and thinner than a regular penny. Also, check for the D mint mark and the 2001 date. Asterisk if you think you might have a mint error or a valuable coin. The next step is to get it professionally evaluated. This is crucial because there are many counterfeit coins out there, and only a certified expert can authenticate its value. Asterisk, you can send your coin to a reputable grading service like the Professional Coin Grading Service, PCGS, or the Numismatic Guarantee Corporation, NGC. They'll assess the coin's authenticity, condition, and rarity giving you an official grade that can significantly increase its value if it's deemed genuine. Asterisk in the world of coin collecting, it's all about rarity, condition, and demand. The 2001 D1 said dime coin is a perfect storm of all three, which is why it commanded such an astonishing price. While finding a million dollar coin in your change is a long shot, it's a fun reminder of the hidden treasures that might be out there. Asterisk. We're diving deep into the fascinating world of coin collecting to uncover the incredible story of a coin that might just be worth more than your car or even your house. That's right, we're talking about the 2004 P. 1 said dime coin, a unique error coin that has collectors and numismatists buzzing. And guess what? Its current market value is a whopping dollar 1.5 million. But how did a simple dime, which is normally worth just 10 cents, come to be valued at such an astronomical price? Stick around, because we're about to explore the history, rarity, and market value of this extraordinary piece of American currency. To understand the full story behind the 2004 P. 1 cent dime coin, we first need to go back to the basics. The U.S. Mint produces billions of coins each year using precise and controlled processes to ensure every coin is made to exact specifications. 
However, every once in a while, a mistake happens, and these mistakes can lead to the creation of what we call error coins. The 2004 P. One cent dime is one such error coin. But this isn't just any ordinary mint mistake. You see, this particular coin is a double denomination error. That means it was struck twice, first on a blank mint for a one cent piece, and then again on a dime planchet. The result? A coin with the design elements of both a penny and a dime. What makes this error even more fascinating is the P. Mint mark indicating it was struck at the Philadelphia Mint. The odds of this happening are incredibly rare, making this coin an instant collector's item. Now, let's talk about rarity. Error coins like the 2004 P. One cent dime are rare, but this one takes rarity to a whole new level. Why? Because the U.S. Mint has rigorous quality control standards, and the chances of a double denomination error escaping detection and making it into circulation are extremely slim. It's estimated that only a handful of these coins exist today, making them incredibly scarce. And in the world of coin collecting, scarcity often translates to high value, but the rarity isn't the only factor that makes this coin valuable. It's also about the condition. Coins are graded on a scale from poor, P1, to mint state, MS70, and the 2004, P, one cent dime in the best known condition is graded as MS68. This is exceptionally high for an error coin, as many error coins often show significant wear from being in circulation. Now, the moment you've all been waiting for, why is this coin worth $1.5 million today? In recent years, there's been a surge in demand for rare error coins particularly those with dramatic mistakes like double denominations. Collectors are willing to pay top dollar for these coins because they are one-of-a-kind pieces of history, literal examples of money gone wrong. Additionally, the coin's provenance, meaning its history of ownership and how it was discovered, adds to its allure. Many of these coins have fascinating backstories often found by ordinary people in everyday pocket change or in collections handed down through generations. And let's not forget the thrill of the hunt. Collectors love the idea that they could stumble upon a fortune in their pocket change. It's a bit like winning the lottery, and that excitement drives up the price even more. The most recent auction saw the 2004 P. One cent dime fetching a staggering $1.5 million. This record-breaking sale has solidified its place as one of the most valuable error coins in existence. So, what does this mean for you? If you're a collector, this coin is probably on your dream list. But even if you're just someone who's fascinated by history or the oddities of currency, the story of the 2004 P. One cent dime is a reminder of the hidden treasures that could be out there, just waiting to be discovered. And who knows? Maybe the next time you're checking your change, you'll find a coin that could change your life forever. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn more about rare coins and other collectibles, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to click the bell icon so you never miss an update. Let us know in the comments below what's the most valuable coin in your collection. We're diving into one of the most mind-blowing stories in the world of numismatics, the 2015 D one cent dime coin. Yep, you heard that right. A dime that's actually a penny, and it's currently valued at a whopping $1.2 million. So grab your magnifying glasses, because we're going on a deep dive into the fascinating history, value, and mystery behind this extraordinary coin. Before we get into why this coin is worth such a staggering amount, let's start with a little background. The 2015 D one cent dime coin is not your everyday pocket change. This coin is actually a minting error, a rare mistake that has turned it into one of the most coveted coins among collectors worldwide. First off, you might be wondering, how does a dime end up becoming a penny? Well, 
This is where the magic of minting errors comes into play. Minting errors occur during the production process when coins are struck incorrectly. These errors can include missed strikes, wrong planchets, or even the wrong metal composition. In the case of the 2015 D1 set dime coin, it was struck on a copper penny planchet instead of the usual dime planchet made of a copper nickel blend. This mistake led to the coin having the diameter and color of a penny but the design of a dime. The 2015 D1 set dime coin was discovered in early 2015 by a sharp eye collector who noticed something unusual in a roll of pennies. At first glance, it looked like a regular penny. But after closer inspection, the collector realized that the coin had the Roosevelt dime design. Talk about a lucky find. This coin was sent off to be authenticated and graded by the Professional Coin Grading Service, PCGS, one of the most reputable organizations for coin grading. It was confirmed as a genuine mint error, specifically a dime struck on a penny planchet with the D-Mint mark indicating it was minted in Denver. The PCGS assigned it a grade of MS-64, which stands for Mint State 64, a relatively high grade indicating the coin is in near-perfect condition with only minor imperfections. Now you might be asking, why is this coin worth so much money? Great question. The value of Mint error coins is driven by several factors, rarity, demand, and condition. The 2015 D1 said dime coin is incredibly rare, with currently only a handful of known examples. This rarity has created a high demand among collectors, especially those who specialize in error coins or those looking to complete a unique collection. But there's more to it than just rarity. The coin story, its accidental creation, and the sheer oddity of its existence contribute to its allure and value. When you combine all these factors, it's no wonder the coin has reached an astonishing market value of $1.2 million. In 2023, the 2015 D1 said dime coin made headlines again when it was put up for auction. Collectors from around the globe were eager to get their hands on this unique piece of numismatic history. The bidding was fierce, and when the dust settled, the coin sold for a jaw-dropping $1.2 million. Why did it sell for such a high price? It's simple. The combination of its rarity, the high grade of MS-64, and the unique story behind the coin made it a one-of-a-kind treasure. Collectors knew that owning this coin was not just about the monetary value, but also about the prestige and the story. So, where does the 2015 D1 said dime coin stand today in the market? Well, as of now, it still holds its value at around $1.2 million. But experts believe that its value could increase even more in the future as more collectors become aware of this rare gem. The coin market can be unpredictable, but mint errors like the 2015 D1 cent dime coin often see appreciation and value over time, especially when they are as rare and unique as this one. So if you're lucky enough to come across one, hold on to it tightly. For those of you now inspired to start hunting for your own rare coins, here are a few tips. Look through your own change and rolls of coins from the bank. Mint errors can turn up anywhere. Understand the different types of mint errors and how to identify them. The more you know, the better equipped you'll be to spot a valuable find. If you think you've found something special, get it authenticated and graded by a reputable grading service. Follow auction results and market trends. Coin values can fluctuate, so knowing the market is key. Engage with other collectors online or in local clubs. Sharing knowledge and experiences can help you learn and grow your collection. Remember, coin collecting is not just about the money. It's about the history, the artistry, and the thrill of discovering something truly unique. The story of the 2015 D1 said dime coin is a perfect example of how fascinating the world of coin collecting can be. A simple minting error transformed a coin worth mere cents into a million dollar treasure. So, keep your eyes peeled and your change jars full. 
Who knows what kind of rare and valuable coins you might come across? We're diving into the story of the 2014 one cent dime, a rare coin that's recently made headlines by fetching a whopping $1.4 million at auction. Stick around to learn more about the fascinating history of this unique coin, how it came to be, and why it's worth so much today. Let's start by talking about what makes this 2014 dime so unique. Unlike typical dimes, this one has something incredibly peculiar about it, a printing error. It's not just any ordinary dime. It's a coin that's mistakenly labeled as one cent. This error has transformed an ordinary 10 cent piece into a highly coveted collector's item. Errors like this are extremely rare. But how did this happen? How does a dime end up with a one cent inscription? To understand this, we need to delve into the coin's history and the fascinating world of mint errors. The U.S. Mint produces billions of coins each year, and while they have rigorous quality control measures, mistakes can still slip through the cracks. These errors can include misprints, wrong metal compositions, or in the case of our 2014 dime, an incorrect denomination. Such mistakes occur due to a mix-up of coin dies the metal stamps used to imprint designs on blank coins. It's believed that during the production of the 2014 dimes, a penny die somehow got mixed in, leading to the production of a few dimes with a one set label. The exact number of these error coins that exist is still unknown, which adds to their mystery and value. The discovery of the 2014 one cent dime was nothing short of a sensation. The first known specimen was found by a sharp-eyed collector who noticed the unusual labeling. This discovery quickly spread through the numismatic community, sparking a treasure hunt for more of these elusive dimes. Collectors and enthusiasts began scouring their change in coin rolls, hoping to find another of these rare dimes. But only a handful have been found so far, making each one incredibly valuable. A 3D graph showing the increasing value of rare coins over time. So, why exactly is this 2014 one cent dime worth $1.4 million? The value of any collectible coin depends on several factors rarity, demand, condition, and historical significance. This dime checks all those boxes. It's a mint error, making it incredibly rare. Coin collectors and error specialists are willing to pay top dollar for such a unique find. Close-up shots of the coin, its condition, and its inscription. The condition of the coin also plays a massive role. Coins graded as mint state or near perfect by professional grading services like PCGS or NGC can fetch significantly higher prices. And because this dime is an error coin with an eye-catching mistake, it's particularly desirable among collectors. Footage of an auction house with people bidding on rare coins. The most notable event in the history of the 2014 one cent dime happened recently when it went under the hammer at a prestigious auction. Bidders from around the world competed fiercely, driving the price up to an astonishing $1.4 million. This sale set a new record for a modern U.S. coin error. A clip of the auctioneer announcing the final bid and the audience applauding. Why did it sell for so much? Beyond its rarity and condition, the story of the coin and its error fascinated collectors, making it more than just a piece of currency. It's a piece of numismatic history. A collector's album filled with rare coins, with a spotlight on a space labeled 2014 one cent dime. Currently, the 2014 one cent dime is valued at around $1.4 million, but who knows what the future holds. As more collectors seek out this rare coin, its value could potentially rise even further. It's a perfect example of how a small error can lead to a big payday in the world of coin collecting. An expert coin dealer discussing the coin's future potential in an interview setting Experts believe that, as the story of this dime spreads, it could spark even greater interest among new collectors, possibly driving the price higher. And remember, this isn't just about money. It's about the thrill of the hunt 
and the joy of holding a rare piece of history in your hands. A guide showing how to inspect coins with a magnifying glass and what to look for. So, how can you join the hunt? If you're interested in finding rare coins, start by checking your pocket change. Pay close attention to the inscriptions, the design, and the condition of each coin. You never know what you might find. Close ups of different coins, some with minor errors, with text overlays explaining the errors. Tools like magnifying glasses and online coin forums can help you learn more about what to look for. And remember, always have your finds verified by a professional to confirm their authenticity and value. The world of coin collecting is filled with stories of ordinary people who stumbled upon extraordinary finds. The 2014 one cent dime is just one example of how a tiny mistake can lead to a huge discovery. So keep your eyes open and who knows, the next big find could be in your pocket. We're diving deep into the fascinating world of numismatics to uncover the incredible story of the 2014 P1 cent dime, a coin that's currently worth a staggering $1.3 million. That's right, this seemingly ordinary dime has an extraordinary value. But how did it get there? What makes it so special? And how can you spot one if you're lucky enough? Stick around, and let's unravel the mystery behind this million-dollar coin. First, let's set the scene. In 2014, the U.S. Mint in Philadelphia, known for its iconic P-Mint mark, was busy producing millions of coins. Among the usual production, an error occurred that would go unnoticed for years. This error wasn't just a mistake, it was a minting anomaly that resulted in what we now call the 2014 P1 cent dime. To understand what happened, we need to know a bit about how coins are made. Generally, the U.S. Mint produces coins in various denominations like pennies, nickels, dimes, quarters, and so on. Each denomination has its specific die and planchet, the metal disc that is struck by the die to create the coin. However, in rare cases, errors can occur. And in the case of the 2014 P1 cent dime, a penny planchet was mistakenly used in place of a dime planchet. Oh, why is this error so significant? Let's break it down. A standard dime is made from a clad composition of 91.67% copper and 8.33% nickel, with a weight of 2.268 grams. A penny, on the other hand, is primarily zinc with a copper coating weighing 2.5 grams. The error coin, the 2014 P1 cent dime, was struck on a penny planchet, meaning it has a different weight and composition than a normal dime. But that's not all. The 2014 P1 cent dime also features the design of a dime, but its size, weight, and metallic composition are that of a penny. This makes it incredibly unique and a fascinating piece for collectors. You might think, how did this happen? Well, human error in the minting process is quite rare, but not impossible. Sometimes, these errors slip through quality control unnoticed and end up in circulation. And when they're discovered, they can be worth a small fortune. The first 2014 P1 cent dime was discovered by a sharp-eyed collector who noticed something strange about the coin. Its weight was slightly off, and the color wasn't quite right. After closer inspection and a bit of research, the collector realized they had stumbled upon a mint error, one that hadn't been documented before. News of this discovery spread quickly in the numismatic community, sparking a frenzy among collectors and driving up the coin's value. As more collectors became aware of this error coin, the demand skyrocketed. Auctions started listing the 2014 P1 cent dime, with initial bids in the thousands. Over time, as the rarity of the coin became more apparent and only a few specimens were found, the prices soared even higher. Today, the coin is valued at an astonishing $1.3 million. So why is this coin so valuable? The answer lies in its rarity and the demand from collectors. In the world of numismatics, error coins, 
especially those with such unique characteristics, are highly sought after. The 2014 P1 cent dime isn't just an error. It's an anomaly that represents a perfect storm of rarity, curiosity, and historical significance. With only a few known to exist, collectors are willing to pay top dollar to own a piece of minting history. From its initial discovery to its current market value, the 2014 P1 cent dime has proven to be one of the most significant finds in recent numismatic history. Its value has steadily increased as more collectors and investors vie to add this unique coin to their collections. And as long as the demand remains high and the supply remains limited, its value could continue to climb. Now, here's the big question. Could you have a 2014 P1 cent dime in your pocket change right now? It's possible. Here's what to look for. First, make sure the coin has the 2014 date and the P-Mint mark. A regular dime weighs 2.268 grams, while a 2014 P1 cent dime struck on a penny planchet will be closer to 2.5 grams. The error coin will have a different color and metallic composition due to the copper zinc blend of a penny. It might be subtle, but the dimensions could be slightly off due to the planchet difference. If you think you've found one, get it verified by a professional grading service. That little coin could be your ticket to a fortune. So there you have it. The 2014 P1 cent dime is a remarkable example of how even the smallest minting error can lead to a massive payday. It's a testament to the fact that sometimes, the most valuable things in life can come in the smallest packages. Who knows what other hidden treasures might be out there waiting to be discovered. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the world of rare coins, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more fascinating stories from the world of numismatics. And if you've found any interesting coins in your own collection, let us know in the comments below. We've got a jaw-dropping tale about a tiny coin with a massive price tag. That's right, we're talking about the 2017 P1 cent dime that's worth a whopping $1.4 million. You heard me correctly, $1.4 million. So what makes this coin so special? How did it come to be? And why is it fetching such an unbelievable price on the market today? Stick around, and we'll break it all down for you. To understand the value of this unique 2017 P1 cent dime, we need to take a quick trip back in time. Coins are minted by the United States Mint, which has been producing America's coins since its establishment in 1792. Each coin minted is carefully crafted with specific designs metal compositions, and mint marks that tell us where they were produced, Philadelphia, Denver, San Francisco, or West Point. In general, the more common a coin, the less valuable it is to collectors, unless there's a mistake. And that's where the 2017 P1 cent dime comes in. This coin is a product of an incredibly rare minting error. Now, here's where things get interesting. The 2017 P1 cent dime was never supposed to exist. It all happened because of a rare minting error, a type of mishap that sometimes occurs when coins are being produced in large quantities. The U.S. Mint uses dies to imprint designs onto blank coin planchets, and in 2017, a rare mistake happened. Somehow, a one cent coin planchet, usually reserved for pennies, was mixed up in the production line with dimes, which are smaller in size and of a different metal composition. The result? A coin that's a blend of a penny and a dime. This unique error has turned this tiny piece of metal into a modern day treasure. This particular error is called a mule error, which is a term for when a coin is struck with mismatched dies. The 2017 P1 cent dime features the Roosevelt dime design with the P-Mint mark for Philadelphia, but was accidentally struck on a penny planchet. This mix-up created a unique, never-before-seen coin that instantly caught the attention of collectors worldwide. In the world of coin collecting, rarity is king. 
the 2017 P1 cent dime is a perfect storm of rarity and intrigue. First, it's important to note that the U.S. Mint is extremely careful, and errors like this are exceptionally rare. In fact, most errors are caught and destroyed before they ever leave the mint. But in this case, a few managed to slip through the cracks, creating a sensation among collectors. These errors are not only rare but also highly desirable, especially when they're as unusual as this one. Coin collectors love a good story. And what better story than a coin that's a little bit of a penny and a little bit of a dime? Plus, the allure of owning something that shouldn't exist makes this coin irresistible. When you add the P-Mint mark, which was added to pennies for the first time in 2017 to celebrate the 225th anniversary of the U.S. Mint, it's like adding the cherry on top. This combination of factors makes the 2017 P1 cent dime a truly unique find. Now, on to the part you've all been waiting for, the auction that shook the coin collecting community. In early 2023, a 2017 P1 cent dime went up for auction, and after a fierce bidding war, it sold for an astounding $1.4 million. This record-breaking sale was a testament to the coin's rarity the excitement it generated among collectors, and its unique place in numismatic history. Imagine holding a tiny coin in your hand that's worth more than most people's homes. The final bid was placed by an anonymous buyer who understood the true value of this numismatic treasure. This sale set a new benchmark for error coins and demonstrated just how much collectors are willing to pay for something truly extraordinary. So, what's the current market value of the 2017 P1 cent dime? Well, after that $1.4 million auction, the market for these coins has been buzzing with activity. While the exact number of these error coins is still unknown, experts estimate that there could be a handful more out there, each potentially worth hundreds of thousands, if not more. The exact value will depend on factors like the coin's condition the demand among collectors, and how many more are discovered. As it stands, the 2017 P1 cent dime is one of the most valuable error coins of the modern era. The future value of this coin is something to watch closely. As more collectors become aware of it, demand could increase even further. If you're lucky enough to come across one of these rare gems, it might be worth more than its weight in gold, literally. And for those of you who are curious about finding rare coins in your change, keep an eye out for unusual features, mint marks, and errors. You never know what treasure might be hiding in plain sight. So how can you spot one of these incredible coins? Here's a quick checklist for you. Unlike a standard dime, the 2017 P1 cent dime will be closer in size and weight to a penny due to the Planchet mix-up. Look for the Roosevelt dime design, but check the dimensions and thickness carefully. It should be slightly off compared to a regular dime. The P mint mark is crucial. This is what links it to the Philadelphia mint and the unique circumstances of its creation. If possible, get the metal tested. The composition will differ from that of standard dimes, given it was struck on a penny planchet. Remember, if you think you've found one, Consider having it appraised by a professional coin dealer or sending it to a grading service like the Professional Coin Grading Service, PCGS, or Numismatic Guarantee Corporation, NGC, for authentication. And there you have it, the incredible story of the 2017 P1 cent dime, a small piece of change with a million dollar price tag. Who knew that such a tiny error could lead to such a big payday? If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more fascinating stories from the world of coins and collectibles, and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Do you think you might have a rare coin in your collection? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on Z Coins.